I mean, it doesn't really feel fair to do this now, but considering I clicked the button that lets me do partner abilities, I'm pretty sure I am just going to assume that I'm actually using partner abilities. Even if I don't have them. And I can't really do make any progress in the main story until I get Kent C's lunch money. So, here we are on a ghostly oven. Uh, chugging, chugging along on our rugged adventure with our ghostly friend. Cause, um... Actually, if the egg was with Chet, with Chet Ripple or Rip Cheeto, I'm always gonna get the two mixed up. What is in the egg bush? I guess we'll find out. Coin in the coin bush. Coin in this coin bush. And in the egg bush is a prison key. Key to the prison in Bowser's castle. Now, where is that in the check off list? Well, at least we're gonna get a party member shortly, which means that they get, with the way the progression AI works. We're gonna get super scaled up shortly. And things are gonna be even harder than they already are. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. You're looking for mail because you're. you messed up the mail. But post office people are our heroes, so we're gonna help you out regardless. Also, I never actually. T also, with Pear Carry, at least we won't have to worry about not being able to get letters. Or be able to deliver letters. What letters do I even have again? Merlin and Told Town. Mort T in Koopa Village. Actually, do I get a. For sign, I'm sorry, Wacka. Hi, I'm Wacka. Just another perfect per day at Mount Rocket. Woo! The sunshine, fresh air, refreshing Wacka do. I'm sorry, I have to know for science. That was not worth it. In the science slightest. I have to include this in the notes, even though it's completely pointless. You don't see me, you don't see me, you don't see me, you don't see me. Ugh. Also, I just realized, going through here without Bombette is gonna suck because of the class. Maybe I shouldn't have put that POW block in storage. Also, to note that freaking deep down pound was also in the shop, and I didn't... I wasted my money on other things. Well, but it's okay, folks, because we got ourselves a mystery here. It's all good. And another coconut. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh, I have power quick. What? Why was I worried about some measly clefts? I mean, I don't have FP. I'm not made out of FP, but I, at least, I think I can at least survive. With the FP restoring items that I did bring with me. I think now's a good time as I need to burn that stinky herb. Oh no, that's right. The letters I have to give the pair carry are going to be randomized. So. I might be more screwed than I thought. And I may have to abuse. Ghost partners a bit more than I was expecting. And then let me see if I can find the other letter locations real quick. A mushroom. And here goes something.
I think I'm gonna want that. But it's one of those things that I never really figured out how to get up there, isn't it? I missed down bet. You know, for science, what happens if I first strike on the field with a partner that I don't actually have? What is it with Mount Rugged being full of freaking coconuts? Oh, Bozo. Have a present. Okay, yeah. Makes sense. <laughs> right. How do I get myself up there? Oh, is that it? So, question number two. How do I get to that treasure chest? You know what, just so I don't have to worry about coming back here later. Do I refuse to pick it out up out of honor? Sure. Nothing else, I can just keep it in storage until I actually get pear curry proper. But do I- I really don't want to waste FP every time I do that. Uh, I guess this will be a good test to see if I get at least pierce the defense. No. I can last her might. I forget if they have two defense or more. But I really don't want to burn my FP. Actually, coconut! Time to shine! <laughs> okay. Never mind, people. We're all good. We have a plan B for the clefts. I never- I never actually knew coconuts penetrate defense. Oh no, I just realized we only have one semi-unlimited resource of coconuts so far. I mean, we still haven't tried Lack of Luster. We haven't seen... If he goes in enough to do... Okay, one damage. It's definitely not an ideal situation, but... It's a situation I can do that doesn't waste FP. Nor Coconuts. Which I'm pretty much- I think I'm gonna just refer to them as whack a bumps For the rest of the stream. Welp! Happy star piece of me! Now... I gotta get that Jade Raven. See, this just takes me back, though. Oh, nope! Got it! Alright. So, at least the trip out here hasn't been a complete waste. <sighs> Do I ch use pair carry to get that letter now I am th I'm, I'm gonna because it might be a situation where I have to if it's one of the letters I have to give to pair carry I kind of but it's, if it's a letter to give to pair carry but you need pair carry to get it then I may have reached a contradiction though so, yeah, that gives me three letters I guess we could find out if it has to be the three specific letters that you normally would give to pair of carry, or it can just be any three letters that you've picked up along the way. I said... Oh no. You're not spiky? Oh no, that's right, I have spike shield on. 
and I kind of let my FP get a little carried away, so I'm just not going to play around. If I really need more FP, I can just go back and heal. I think I even still have a maple syrup sitting around. Okay, what magical seed are you gonna give to me today? Well, <laughs> I mean, it's at least flower themed. Yeah, I'll grow your seed, I guess. Alright. Oh, I've been this way, alright. At least now I have no excuse to get the mushroom. Okay, I actually kind of don't want to get rid of my coconuts, because... That's some solid... FP recover. That's some solid damage against an enemy that I normally can't damage. Um, what do we want to sack in case this doesn't work? Alright. Fun. It's gonna despawn before I can get up there, isn't it? Fantastic. Oh, it's definitely gonna be gone now. Oh, I mean, hey, at least I get a level up out of all this. I'm just in time for some more BP. Right. There's no way that fire flowers. Yep, it's long gone. I mean, it's fine. I can always buy more at the shop. Right. For now, though, I guess I gotta just go to that last letter location. Well, I mean, at least got a mushroom to replace the one I lost. Now, before going onwards, let's just see if I can get Paracarry while I'm here. So, I mean, with the, with the class in mind, it could have been a lot worse. I didn't even have to burst through my coconuts too much. Alright, time for a moment of truth. Oh, that's one. I think it's so easy to find it. Um, cool, it can just be any three. Yay, now I don't have to feel so bad about cheating with using Paracarry. Because now I have the real deal. Oh, shoot! <laughs> He's a male carrying Paracoupa who's looking for lost mail. So I guess we'll never know if I can deliver mail with Ghost Paracarry. It's fine. <laughs> I'm just glad we're actually making progress in that chapter. Though it just came to my realization we're probably gonna have to backtrack from here too because we actually need a key item in order to get into Dry Dry Ruins. So, the normal folks aren't going to have it. And actually, I just realized the trees might be randomized. So, the lemon may not even be here. Or may not even be in this original location. And hello, Buzzar. Goodbye, Buzzar. I am Wa Luigi, but my friends just call me Luigi. And hey, I'm not lying. Alright. I might as well go as far as I can here and pick up as many key items as I can along the way. Maybe I'll fight Buzzard on the way back. Probably wouldn't hurt to like... Because I'm a little, being a little low, over level, I might need some experience. Are there any key items in the desert itself? Hmm. 
great. Am I really gonna go out of the path to see? You gotta hit the block at least and see if the mushroom's there. <laughs> Good thing I decided to check the block. Oh no. Well, where, first of all, where's the water stone? Water stone, you gotta be on this list somewhere. Oh, here it is, water stone. <sighs> but that means I gotta... That means there's a chance I'll have to hit this block several more times. Well... Oh, thank you. Thank you for reducing the amount of time that takes to show up. Unfortunately, like, I don't want to get rid of anything. I guess a mushroom, only because I can get, I know I can get more of them. I really should toss the coconuts, but uh, for right now, they're my best defense against clefts. I know I'm out of the area about clefts, but I'm still worried about them. Oh, that's right, the pokies are just a different color. Might as well, like, get a gauge of how strong the enemies are and how much we're experience we're gonna get. And actually, oh yeah, upgrade blocks aren't randomized, so I can still get the upgrade block from the Oasis. It'd be nice to actually have someone upgraded. It's tempting as... Don't burn all your... Don't burn all your flower points in one battle. I probably am a little stingy with my FP items, but still. I could just do it next time. I'm trying to think of if there's any other... Well, there's definitely other items, which sucks because, you know, I might as well just scroll the entire desert, because <laughs> it's not, any item could be a key item. Well, montage time, I guess. Good, you're stuck over there. Um, will you still be here after the battle? Let's find out. <laughs> Cause I can just... As far as I'm concerned, I can just burn this fire flower here. Cause otherwise I'm gonna be wasting so many items. Mm. You know what? Let me just burn this mystery. Wait, was there something different about that? Super Shroom. I don't know, but that wasn't... I'm not gonna lie, that was nice. I didn't think that this would be the Desert Coming episode, but here we are. Might as well scourge every square inch of this place, because I don't remember where, which items are which, so I don't want to, like, miss something in because I never paid that much attention to the regular items. Oh, I forgot to check that we actually got Paracarry. Which makes me feel which makes me feel sad because that Bombet got left behind. I wonder if Pokey still drop dry fruits. Probably not. I mean, I'll take it. Kind of... Bad situation, considering I'm so full on items already. Well, there's a calculator! Told you that it'd be worth our time to just gorge every single inch of the desert. And imagine, I would have had no idea that freaking calculator is there, because that is a freaking invisible block. I don't even think there... I knew that there was an item in that spot before. At least we get we get treated with different color pokies every time we go somewhere. Mm -hmm. So that's where we put the pole stone. If I had one, oh 
shoot. I had a plan, but the map was done poorly. Yeah, if I have any spare FP items, now might be a good time to... Burn them after all. Well, I mean, besides the jam and jelly. No, I kind of wanted to pick up an item, sir. At least, like, with the 2 FP recovery that the... And it's gone. Just gone like the wind. The sigh. This feels like a very inefficient way to... check for items. But at least... it's a furrow way to check for the items. I mean, I have... actually... I have Spike Shield on. Oh, that's right, it only does one each. Cool! I always HP and FP. Too bad I don't have... Ooh, I don't know. A roast shroom or something? Or a shroom fry? I guess I can't it can't be fall. It's not like I threw it away. Only for it to be lost to the ether, but it could have been perfectly useful to have on hand right about now. That set oh Oh yeah, like Plenty of coins to pay off can see. Whatever I want is resume the normal story progress. Which knowing this game I probably won't even be able to get to do because of like Yeah, there's keys to the Kimbrough's Fortress. But before I forget... Cool, and the only FP recovery I have is the Jam and Jelly. Really nothing over here? Actually, I don't really need the lime. I just gotta do the item combination. Or buy the items from the shop in the... In order that he tells you about. Warehouse key. All the way at Shiver City. Where was... Oh, that's right. That's where that goes. It's been a while, I completely forgot about that part of the game. Or more so that there was a t key tie behind it. Aha! You didn't think I see you there. Random question block. With another letter. I think I'm... I wonder if that's the beginning or the end of that letter chain quest. Either way, I think the item would be randomized, so I guess it doesn't really matter that much. I, more I think about it, coming to the dry dry as desert at this point wasn't necessarily a bad idea because it's a little tedious, but there is a lot of items to pick up. Probably would have been sitting on a bunch of these if I didn't just scroll the desert relatively carefully. Alright, are you gonna be a single coin? Yup. Oh, that's right, you're not directional. This is not Dark Star. It's a shame we don't have FP, because this would be a good scenario to actually burn some FP. You know what? Ugh, in memory of our good friend, Wacka. Wacka would want us to be happy, and by happy I mean alive. Well, that's a convenient place for that to fall. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna stop by the oasis first. Alright, let's see what's in this tree. <laughs> Ooh. How much BP does that cost? Oh, I could actually equip it. How much FP does it cost? That's the part I was worried about. Alright. 
unfortunately is not... Well, there's our Koopa leaves for our Koopa Tees that we're definitely never going to come back for. And there's the upgrade block. Alright. Tough choice. But I guess it's not as extreme because charge ain't really going to be much use. So I'm basically choosing between evasion hacks or spamming dizzy. I'll, I guess Paracarry exists too. Yeah, I don't know if I... I think I've always taken this shell for granted, and knowing how good it actually is now... Might be a good time to alleviate that. Alright. I think I'm already full on items, otherwise I would get another Koopa Leaf, just because I've been finding myself short on PP. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, you know what? Sure. Just so I have something and I can like spam my power quakes and all that without any regret regret. Yeah, because like that's one power quake, it's pretty much an entire Koopa Leaf and then some. Like, I don't see myself ever backtracking here to farm for them, but I might as well get them while I can. Oh! Awesome. Definitely wanted that. Anything actually worth fighting around here? I think it's just coins in these skinny trees, so I don't have to worry about items hidden in them. It's kind of... Do I really gotta whack every single one of these trees, though? Let me double-check these, because I thought... There's a vague memory I have of there being a letter in one of them for some convoluted reason. And now I'm scared. Because if there was a letter, then that could be literally anything. And there was a lot of skinny trees, especially a lot of skinny trees that I passed over. Oh, hey! <laughs> it's a good thing I remember that, the, that there's a letter in one of the skinny trees. We need that for story progress. We need that badly for story progress. I think that's the only skinny tree. I don't know if I really should scavenge the entire desert again. Just to check all the trees. I wish I would have thought about doing that sooner. Am I crazy? I think one of these is just a coin block, but... I'll take the money. And I think now Cooper actually does more damage or at least the same amount of damage as Lackluster. Which is honestly a little unfortunate. Because that means I'm not really going to get use out of him too much anymore. At least until I upgrade him again. Which, yeah, there is a... I'm not going... I'm not crazy. There is an upgrade block in the dry-dried ruins. Right? 